what up what's good you guys it's your boy demons here we're coming out with another banger for you guys we have a new installment in the self-aware horror genre series scream titled scream just like the original which i think they did it to mock uh the new movies that are naming their sequels after the original like halloween did you know it's a self-aware movie so they got to do all the horror movie tropes i saw this trailer a couple months ago and i was extremely excited i've always loved the scream franchise it's always been so fun and entertaining to me so i was definitely excited to come into this one now rest in peace to wes craven he was not involved with this of course but i think the directors that took over they did also ready or not they did a phenomenal job it felt like a scream movie to me and i was really pleasantly surprised the whole time i was enjoying it I enjoyed the performance by Ghostface. Now, sometimes I could tell that it was a different character because it was a little weak, and you could tell, okay, so that's not, you know, it's a whodunit. So you're trying to figure it out. You're trying to watch and see and pick up clues and see who the Ghostface killer or killers are going to be. Now, I'm not going to go into spoilers here. I'm not going to say who it was, but I did. Me and my friend had a very great time trying to figure it out and see who it was. So that kept me really entertained as well. If you guys like Scream movies, you will like this one. They go into the movie talking about how it's a requel. And so they have the legacy characters, you know, Sidney Prescott, Gail Weathers, Officer Dewey. You got a whole new group here, friends. The new main character, I thought they, well, there's a couple main characters really, I think. That's more of a family. I think they did a great job. I enjoyed their performances, the uh, Sam Carpenter and Tara Carpenter. And then the other friends, you know, some of them are really entertaining, like the twins, which are Randy Meeks, the nephew. Shout out Randy Meeks, the goat. And then we have some characters in here that are just there to get killed, basically. Speaking of that, the kills, there were some great kills in this movie. Ghostface is brutal. I had a lot of fun with it. But to sum it all up, this is just a quick video. I don't want to get into any spoilers or anything. If you guys enjoy the Scream movies, you'll enjoy this movie. If you can go into a movie not expecting everything to make sense and you have some suspension of disbelief, you're going to enjoy this movie. I'm pretty sure everybody's seen a Scream movie. That is what you're going to get. I enjoyed it. As you can see, I'm a big horror fan. I had a lot of fun and I thought it was a great way to start 2022. But thank you very much, guys. If you want me to do another video going into more spoilers and stuff with my friend, let me know down in the comments below. I appreciate you guys watching. If you do watch it, leave a comment and tell me what you think. Leave a like, subscribe. We're coming out with more and more bangers, guys. All sorts of videos. If you guys want to see something, let me know and we'll get it done. I'm down for whatever. But this is going to be it for me, guys. Thank you so much. Y'all stay easy, man.